Hey guys, welcome to another tier ranking, and look at this shit, guys. Look at this. This is the AFI's top 100 greatest films of all time. I put them all in a tier list. That's right, guys. AFI top 100 greatest films of all time. Tier ranking by yours truly. Holy moly. This is gonna be annoying, and if this is gonna be long... Well, maybe I can maybe, you know, quick make this go by in a more timely manner. So, yeah. Holy Lord. If you guys don't know what the AFI is, the American Film Institute, uh, every couple of years they, you know, fix up the, their top 100 greatest films of all time. But as of now, these are all the films that are on their top 100 greatest films of all time. I'm going to grab all these movies and put it into my tier list. Uh, I have the S, A, B, C, D tier list, and Never Seen. There are a couple on here I have not seen, and they're going to go in the Never Seen. Um, I don't have an F tier, because I don't think any of these films are F tier quality. I'm even going to try to find if there's even a D tier quality. There might be. So, yeah. Let's get to it. Uh, I'm going to start off with the Never Seen, so because there's nothing to say about the movies. Uh, then I have not seen it, so let, let, let's see. I know there's a few in here. Uh, Duck Soup by the Marx Brothers, I have not seen. I heard it's really fucking good. Uh, the Best Years of Our Lives, I heard it was good. I haven't seen it. Uh, Night at the Opera, I have not seen. Um... Bear with me, guys. I know. I know. Oh, this is Intolerance, the sound film. It's good. I haven't seen it. Um, there's another one. I'm pretty certain there's another one on here that I have not seen. Um, yeah. Okay. So, there we go. Okay, the rest of them I've seen. I've seen all these other films, so it's pretty good. I have 100 films. I've only not seen a couple. Uh, what's this? Oh, I know this movie. Okay, yeah, I've seen that. Um, Alright, uh, there's a few I'm just going to just throw on the list, and uh, I don't know, there's not a lot to say about them, I guess, but I don't know, because just... There's a lot of movies here. I can't talk in huge detail about all of them, so... Bridge of the River Kwai, that's an A tier right there. Alec Guinness, so good. I uh, love this movie. Love that it's a, it's like a prison camp movie, uh, kind of like Great Escape. I think it's better than Great Escape. You know, Great Escape's a lot more entertaining. This one's just a better acted film, but really good film. Um, Goodfellas is an S tier. I will always, always praise Goodfellas. It is a top tier movie. It is one of the greatest mob films of, of all time. Ray Liotta, Robert De Niro, Joe Pesci are all amazing. It's a great story about the underground underground belly of the mob. It's amazing. Lord of the Rings. I love that the only Lord of the Rings movie is Fellowship of the Ring, which is great because it is literally my favorite Lord of the Rings movie. It started it all. I, I know everyone will always say Return of the King is the best it is an amazing film, Return of the King. It's such a good movie. But The Fellows of the Ring is it's, it's such a better story to me. I love the story. I love the introduction to all these great characters and this amazing journey you go on. The action is good, but the world and the characters is what really makes it. Plus, it's beautiful score. I, I love Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring. Saw that movie twice in theaters. And I remember when I bought the VHS, VHS tape of that and just watched it the shit out of that movie. It's, it's so good. Who's afraid of Virginia Wolf? Virginia Wolf. Who's afraid of Virginia Wolf? That's an A tier. That's a really great movie. This is a, it's a play about two people who like lost their son and how they almost like absolutely hate each other with a passion. And they meet this like young couple who are happy and newly married and they basically are trying to get them to Show them how awful marriage is. It's a really fucked up movie, but it's a really good movie. Richard Burton and, most importantly, Elizabeth Taylor are incredibly good in this film. Platoon is a fantastic movie, too. That, that's an A tier as well. 
Wizard of Oz in A tier as well. It's it's a beautiful musical. It's so iconic. It's so good. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful Wizard of Oz. Clockwork Orange. Sorry guys, it, a Clockwork Orange is such a well crafted, well constructed film. It is so unbearably unwatchable. I've seen the movie once, like twelve years ago. I thought it was well done, but I'll never watch that miserable movie ever again. Sorry, just, I can't do it. So, it, it loses marks for me. All About Eve is a great movie. It's not a masterpiece, but it is a solid film. Rear Window is my all-time favorite uh, Hitchcock movie. I, it's uh, one of my favorite films of all time. I think it's one of the best uh, suspenseful thrillers ever made. I love it. Jimmy Stewart and Grace Kelly. Wow, she is a knockout in this movie. Super Pirate Ryan, yep, it's fantastic. The Searchers, yep, it's fantastic. Rocky, oh, I gotta go ask you for Rocky. It's, it's fucking, it's Rocky. It is the ultimate underdog story. It's the ultimate boxing story. It is just amazing. It's just amazing. Bringing Up Baby is a very good movie. I, I, it's not like 10 out of 10 perfect, but like, Cary Grant and what's her name? Um, Catherine Hepburn. They're great. Pulp Fiction. Yeah, A tier. Do the Right Thing. I'll go B. It's a good movie, an important film, but again, it's just not a movie I watch a lot. Here we go. First controversial take The Apartment's a nest tier. I don't care. I know a lot of people don't love it. I love it. I think it's an amazing movie. I think it's a great dark comedy. It's a great dramatic story about suicide. It did deserve Best Picture. I know a lot of people say Psycho, but I, I actually think The Apartment's better. Psycho's here, though, and I'll put that in the A tier, so there you go. All the President's Men. I'm going to go B. It's a great movie, but it's not a movie that I watch a lot. It's like MASH. MASH is okay. I don't know. It's, I don't know. I know when that feels away. It's It's okay. Uh, The Graduate, that's an A. Taxi Driver, that, 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 that's an S. I think that's, it's one of Scorsese's great best films of all time, so. Right there with Raging Bull. Raging Bull's an S, too. Tootsie, Tootsie's a B. That's a funny movie. Like, it, like it's a good, lighthearted comedy film. American Graffiti is a great coming-of-age story. Uh, West Side Story, that's an S right there, man. That's a perfect movie. Ben Hur, that's an S. That's a perfect movie. Deer Hunter, amazing, but a little too depressing. It Happened One Night, it's a great movie. Dr. Strange Loves, great movie. Apocalypse Now, it's a great movie, a little depressing. Jaws, S tier. Everyone knows how much I love Jaws, and just it's one of Spielberg's best films, and it's got like three amazing characters that really make the movie. Man, I'm through this run through this quick. <laughs> King Kong ain't got shit on me. That's B tier. That's a good movie. Got with the Wind. It's an S tier. Six Cents. I'll go B. Raise the Lost Ark. It's an S tier. I don't give a shit, people. Sound of Music is an A tier. The hills are the life of the sound of music. Mary Robbins is better, but I still love that music. It's a great musical. Shawshank Redemption is an A tier. Uh, what is this? Charlie Chaplin. Wh which one is this? What is this? Is this City Lights? It's City Lights. City Lights is an A tier. Chinatown is an A tier. Star Wars is an S tier. Um, it happened one night. Um, not it happened when in the heat of the night they call me Mr. Tibbs. I love in the heat of the night. It's a great movie. Cindy Poitier is amazing. Uh, Rod Steiger is a great movie. It's a great mystery movie, but it's also a great movie about race. Sounds of the Lambs, S tier. Blade Runner. Everyone knows how much I love Blade Runner. Favorite film of all time. Everybody I've talked a lot about this. Did a whole video about Blade Runner. Check it out. Bonnie and Clyde. Bonnie and Clyde is B. That's a good movie. Casablanca, S tier. Double Identity, that's an A. That's a great uh, femme fatale in the war movie. 
Easy Rider is B. The Gold Rush is a B. It's a good Charlie Chaplin movie. But Christ and Sunhead's Kid. On the Waterfront is an S tier. It's that's that is got Marlon Brando as one of his best performances ever. Just just saying. And yeah, Godfather one and two up in the S tier. Sophie's Choice. I gotta go. It's a little. It's great. It's a little overrated though. It's a little overrated. To Kill a Mockingbird is an A. Snow White is B. Sullivan's Travels is a B. Unforgiven. It's another S right there. Man, look at that S tier, man. Holy shit. Yeah, if y'all thought I was harsh on movies before, man, look at this shit, man. So it doesn't want a space odyssey. That's an S. I'm sorry. I love that movie. High Noon is an A. It's a great movie. Gary Cooper, Strick and Evans Desire is an A. Mr. Smith Goes to Washington's an A. Midnight Cowboy's an A. E.T.'s an A. 12 Angry Man is an S tier. Hold on. I gotta make this fucking look like, man. So many fucking movies on here, man. Shit. Schindler's List is an S tier movie, but it's a B tier for me. <laughs> Sunrise, the silent film. It's alright. Modern Times. It's my favorite Charlie Chaplin movie. It's an S tier. African Queen. It's B tier. It's a good movie. Annie Hall. C. Nashville. C. Network. B. Citizen Kane. S tier. Deal with it, people. It's Wonderful Life. One of the greatest Christmas films ever made. Philadelphia Story. A. Last Picture Show. C. Was this? Maltese Fogan, the B. Sing of the Rain, A tier. Wait, that's that's Treasure of Sierra Madra. Well, that's a B tier anyways. Maltese Fogan will go right there with it. Two. Forrest Gump. Forrest Gump's in here? It's pretty good. Wild Bunch. Titanic. Yankee Doodle Dandy. Toy Story! Hell to the fucking yes. Toy Story. On oh, the S tier, Mr. Toy Story. Lawrence Arabia is a perfect movie. I'm sorry. It's a perfect movie. North by Northwest. That's an A right there. Where's the A tier? Cabaret. Overrated as fuck. Shane. B tier. Something like a hot. A tier. Spartacus. A tier. Sons of Boulevard. B tier. French Connection. A tier. B tier, Rips of Wrath, C tier, Vertigo, A tier, holy shit, man, I went through that quick, I, 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 there's so many movies, guys, I just, I, I, I can't just, like, talk about every single one, y'all heard me talk about most of these movies before, I'm sorry, like, you've seen my top ten lists, uh, I'm not even gonna put them in an order, then, that's gonna take forever, but yeah, look at this, this is my S tier right here, I think these are all... 10 out of 10 movies. Good Fellows, Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring, Rear Window, Rocky, The Apartment, Taxi Driver, Raging Bull, West Side Story, Ben Hur, Jaws, Rays of Lost Ark, Gone with the Wind, Star Wars, In the Heat of the Night, Sounds of the Lambs, Blade Runner, Constant Blank, On the Waterfront, Godfather 1, Godfather 2, Unforgiven, 2001 Space Odyssey, 12 Angry Men, Modern Times, Citizen Kane, It's a Wonderful Life, Toy Story, Lawrence of Arabia. 10 out of 10 movies. Does anyone disagree with that? Didn't think so. A tier. I'm not. I'm not doing that for all the kind of reasons. It's the B tier, C tier, and only Cabaret is the overrated film. <laughs> that doesn't deserve to be in the AFI. And still need to see all these movies. Tell me if they're good, if y'all seen them. So there you go. That was my quick little tier ranking for the AFI Top 100 Greatest Films of All Time. Let me know what is your favorite film of the AFI Greatest Films of All Time. If y'all want to know what my favorite is, it's a, that's a stupid question to ask because it's Blade Runner. It's my favorite film of all time. Y'all should know this. Anyways, comment below, let me know, let me know your favorite. Comment below, let me know, and as always, if you like this video, please like and subscribe to this channel, and join the dark side.